The United States and Cuba both said good progress was made at the second round of talks aimed at restoring diplomatic relations that were severed 54 years ago after Cuba's revolution. The latest discussions at the State Department in Washington followed the first round of talks in Havana in January. I can say that we had a good meeting today. We uh, made uh, progress in our discussions. A priority for Cuba is its removal from the U.S. list of state sponsors of terrorism, but diplomats wouldn't be drawn. I don't uh, feel that it would be appropriate for me to go into specifics about which issue we made more or less progress on. But some of them, quite honestly, are, are close to resolution. The negotiations signify a dramatic change in policy by the U.S. towards its communist neighbor. I think President Obama is looking for his legacy. And uh, I think uh, he's looking for something when he leaves office that he can be noted for, like JFK was uh, for uh, his in initiative to put a man on the moon and, and LBJ with, uh, with uh, civil rights. For over 50 years, there has been a relationship of sorts between the two countries, but it's always been through a third party, even though they do have diplomats working in each other's capitals. For now, Cuban interests in the United States are represented by the Swiss embassy right next to me. But within a few months, possibly even weeks, this relic of the Cold War could be history. Stefan Grobe, Euronews, Washington.